Hey guys, it's Joe the Android Guy with PocketNow.com. There seems to be some misunderstanding, some confusion about Flash and Android. You can still get Flash on Android, just not quite as conveniently as you might have hoped. In this video we're going to go into a little bit of why that's the case, and how you can still get Flash 11 on your Android today. Let's go take a look. So a lot of people have hacks. They have hacked browser APKs that you can install with root and put into a specific location, assign permissions, blah, blah, blah. We're not going to do that. Instead, head on over to Adobe's website. I'll have a link for you in the article at pocketnow.com. From there, we are going to scroll all the way down here and take a look at their archived older versions of Flash Player. And check this out. Flash Player for Android 4.x, that's ice cream sandwich jelly bean devices, and then down here for 2.x, 3.x, and, and older than that. What we're going to do is very simply, the first one is Flash Player 11.1, point one fifteen point twenty seven. tap on that, and of course it's going to then start downloading. Once that downloads, it's very fast. You can see here this is the ICS version. There are some people out there who are distributing the Jelly Bean version, but this should work just fine on both. We're going to go ahead and install it. You can see now I can't. This is a side load operation. So I've got to come into my settings. And you guys know this already. I've got to come in here and say, yes, I want to be able to install from unknown sources. I am going to assume the risk and then we should be good. The hard part now is I've got to find where that download was and open it again, but I'm lazy, so I'm just going to go ahead and tap on that. It's going to download it again. It's really, really small and fast. It just adds a dash one to the end of the name. And once that's done, now I can install. It installs pretty quickly. Uh, this is Android Jelly Bean 4.2, so it's going to check that against its known malware database. A little bit of extra protection there for me and then it installs and it's all done. So what I did is I headed over to congregate.com, that's congregate with a K, in my Chrome browser and was told, uh oh, Chrome does not support this plugin. That's not surprising. So firing up Firefox, headed to the same site and I'm uh, playing a game here called Kingdom Rush. You can see I've got this little uh, plugin button it's underneath it, you can't read that, it says tap here to activate plugin. So let's tap there to activate the plugin. Take just a minute. And there you go. I've got Flash right there on my Android. This is Jelly Bean, but this should work on Ice Cream Sandwich and up as long as I've got a browser that respects that plugin, which Firefox does. So it's not impossible to get Flash working on your Android powered device, just a little inconvenient. Hopefully it'll buy us some more time until developers, game developers, come out with either HTML5 versions or native versions of their apps for us. Kind of a fun tip, takes an awful lot of work to do, but Flash isn't dead yet. For Pocket Now, showing off some workarounds, I'm Joe Levi. Thanks for watching.